Hey friends, it's Travplane, here to help you in your journey to Elite Smash. And today I'm going to show you how to beat the giant fire-breathing turtle, Bowser. Like always, I'll show you moves to respect and weaknesses to exploit. Let's get right into it. You wouldn't think a giant tortoise like Bowser would be fast, but he definitely is. His running speed is faster than many smaller characters, which can surprise many players and score him multiple dash attacks and grabs. So, be on your guard when on the ground and at a distance, because he can cover it quickly. In my opinion, Bowser's deadliest move is his forward air, where he swipes his claws and a large arc in front of him. What makes it so scary is its speed, power, and size. It's hard to dodge, and if you're not careful, you can get caught in a string of forward airs. He also uses it to edge guard you. If you're off the ledge and you see him coming after you, try recovering around his forward air. Why Bowser's Fire Breath may seem like a slow move that you could easily avoid, you'd be surprised at how many victims fall prey to it. A good Bowser will corner you with a flame and quickly give you 30% of damage within a matter of seconds. You can't shield it, so don't even try. If you see it coming, move away and jump over it. Bowser is slow to end this move, so try to hit him from the air as quickly as possible. If you can tell that he will have time to pull up his shield before you hit him, then don't attack. Give him space. Why? Because Bowser has a vicious out of shield option, his Whirling Fortress. Bowser goes into his shell and spins along the ground, pulling you into a Whirling Fortress of spikes. But what makes this move so useful is that he can slide a bit along the ground, catching his opponents off guard. Also, this move comes out of shield very fast, so you gotta be careful when attacking Bowser when he's in his shield. If you have good spacing, he can still slide toward you, so respect this move. When Bowser's in the air, he can drop back down to the stage very fast with two options, down air or his Bowser bomb. His down air is dangerous because he can move slightly to the right or left while in the air, and when he lands, it creates a small shock wave, often poking around your shield. And his Bowser bomb is dangerous because it can break shields, putting a quick end to your shield and your stock. So be careful when Bowser's above you. You can bait both of these attacks by jumping up to him, then jumping away, letting him fall past you, and then punishing him. Also, watch out for Bowser Bomb on the ground. He can headbutt you into it and slam you. It deals as much damage as most smash attacks and starts fast. And whatever you do, don't shield through this move, or else. Bowser's Flying Slam is where he grabs you and takes you on a flight with an explosive crash landing. It can kill early, especially if he lands on a ledge, but the main thing to respect is the ability to grab you while in the air. So don't sit there in your shield when he comes down to you or from the air. Move away, give Bowser some distance and respect this move. Bowser can also use this move to carry you off stage and send you to your death, so you better watch out for this grab near the ledge. If your character has a good recovery, you can break out of it and make your way back to the stage. Another thing to respect is Bowser's heavy armor and tough guy attributes. It makes him not flinch from soft jabs when he's beginning certain moves. So, your better option is to grab him instead of jabbing. Bowser has a good ledge trapping game because he's so big and fast, he can cover all the options effectively. Make sure you're mixing up your get up options and you should get past this. Before I get into the weaknesses, Please hit the like button and subscribe if you want more content like this. I'd really appreciate it and it helps a ton. Bowser is big and bulky, which makes him vulnerable to getting stuck in combos. So dish out all your bread and butter combos on him and make him hurt. Bowser is susceptible to getting zoned out with projectiles due to his size and slow attacks. So keep him back and make him suck. You wouldn't think Bowser could get juggled with his down air and Bowser Bomb, but there are all certain characters with strong, long-lasting up airs who can beat them both. Bowser's recovery has decent horizontal movement, but poor vertical movement. His Whirling Fortress can hit you if you're not careful off the ledge. But if you've got a powerful dunk, then... And then have fun beating Bowser.
many think Bowser is the best heavy character. But what do you think? Let me know in the comments below. And also, what characters you'd like me to make a video of next? Look for my videos every Tuesday and Thursday. See ya.